Welcome viewers. In this video, I summarize four key treasury news stories for executives and organizations focused on the world of corporate cash and treasury management. The first news story covers the research report Payments Modernization, The Big Survey 2024. To assess the key payments modernization priorities of banks worldwide, the fourth edition of The Big Survey, an annual research report has been produced by FinExtra in collaboration with Volante Technologies. The annual report, conducted in early 2024, surveyed 350 senior bankers across the globe. Offering a forward-looking perspective, this report aims to reassess the key payments modernization priorities of banks worldwide and highlights areas where the trend towards digitization, real-time and cross-border payments are accelerating. When it comes to payments modernization, most respondents plan to implement imminently, with the majority planning to replace one or more systems within the next six months. The survey results indicate minimal deviation across regions and institutional sizes. Modernization plans are on the agenda for 66% of North American banks within the next six months to a year compared to 76% of European banks. Only Southern Europe and the Nordics indicate a slightly extended payments modernization implementation period, targeting one year instead of six months. In terms of budget allowance, 64% of respondents state that their budgets for payments modernization will increase over the next 12 months, with 72% of North American banks planning to make additional investments of US $500,000 compared to only 51% of European banks. With respect to factors driving payments modernization, the survey report reveals three major pain points influencing payments modernization spending and allocation plans, both from a client and market perspective. These are efficiency and speed of cross-border payments, followed by the cost of payment processing and access to real-time or intraday liquidity. For more insights, click the link in the description below to download the research report about payments modernization in banks across regions and institutional sizes. The second news piece is about ICD being recognized in Delivery Heroes Award win. ICD, an institutional investment technology provider, was recognized as a key partner in a corporate award won by the German multinational online delivery platform Delivery Hero. Delivery Hero was highly commended for having the best investing solution at Treasury Today's 2024 Adam Smith Awards ceremony. The ICD portal and its certified API integration with the SAP Treasury and Risk Management System created a seamless digital process for Delivery Hero to manage cash and investments. With the technology project in place, the Treasury team was able to execute their investment strategy to diversify cash investments, mitigate counterparty concentration risk, and capture opportunities in high-yielding money market funds. Moreover, Christian Shamal, Director of Treasury at Delivery Hero, commented, From a technology perspective, our goal has been to continuously improve standardization across the organization for more efficient and scalable processes and to gain transparency and access to data for better business insights. We were able to do this for cash investments with the ICD portal SAP integration. The third news story highlights the case study Mastercard transforms its AP process worldwide through its partnership with Boost Payment Solutions. In a pioneering collaboration, Boost Payment Solutions streamlined how Mastercard pays its suppliers globally with a one-stop solution that optimizes commercial card utilization and acceptance. Prior to engaging Boost Payment Solutions in 2015, Mastercard predominantly used checks, ACH and wires for supplier payments across various sectors such as facilities management, media, IT, legal, telecommunications and event partnerships. Managing these payments involved cumbersome manual activities. 
to streamline their supplier payment process and leverage the advantages offered by MasterCard commercial card products. MasterCard sought a partner with a robust technical platform and global supplier enablement capabilities. MasterCard then enlisted Boost Payment Solutions to simplify its supplier payments through Boost's proprietary straight-through processing or STP platform Boost Intercept, thereby enabling MasterCard to automate supplier onboarding, payment processing and remittance reporting. Boost Intercept digitizes MasterCard's commercial card payments, automating settlements with suppliers, banks, and delivering payment notifications and detailed remittance reports to suppliers in their preferred formats. By integrating Boost Intercept with MasterCard's virtual card platform InControl, Boost converted email-based outputs from InControl into STP payments globally using locally issued card products with a single click. For further details, follow the link in the description below to access the case study detailing MasterCard's transformation of its global AP process in partnership with Boost Payment Solutions. Next up, we have the fourth and final Treasury news story which focuses on Credible's white paper on transforming treasury management. Credible, an India-based working capital technology platform, has released a white paper titled The Business Value of Working Capital Financing, a Working Capital Guide for the Corporate Treasurer. The white paper delves into the fundamental concept of working capital, its significance within the corporate world, and the economic factors influencing working capital requirements. Credible's white paper also addresses treasury-specific challenges and demonstrates how strategic working capital solutions can generate substantial financial value, impacting both top and bottom lines. Key findings in the white paper reveal the potential for a 6.8% increase in return on assets through efficient cash flow management. Additionally, the white paper addresses the impact of rising inflation, projected to reach 6%, and increased interest rates, now standing at 6.5%, on working capital requirements, further highlighting a 20% rise in the interest service coverage ratio across listed firms in the recent past. Moreover, the report highlights how implementing a software-based cash management system can improve cash flows by 10%. The effective management of working capital is crucial for businesses, especially in today's asset light and uncertain economic environment, said Ram Keval Ramani, co-founder and managing director of Credible. Our white paper provides corporate treasurers with the knowledge and tools they need to navigate these challenges and optimize their working capital strategies for sustained financial success, Keval Ramani further added. Thank you for watching all four Treasury news stories. We are grateful for your time and attention. Stay tuned for more updates and please share this video. Subscribe to our channel, listen to the Open Treasury podcast and explore articles, interviews and industry roundups on ctmfile.com, your trusted source for all things Treasury. Thank you and have a great week.